Uh, I'll point out the uh, tail head of to the head. Tape. This wasn't head to head, <laughs> by the way. It was head over a head. He's like nine inches taller, Eduardo Perez. Just five inches via the reach, though, and uh, about 50 pounds. 40 pounds. My math's terrible. I immediately think of the matchup Eduardo Perez versus Goliath. Yep. When I saw that, Fight, when I ready? saw those guys head-to-head head right there, I was Fight. like, this guy needs to be fighting Goliath. Well, the thing is, Goliath down there in uh, Guadalajara is one thing, but you pointed out, Perez is trained with Daniel Cormier and Cain Velasquez. Those guys don't let just anybody get on a mat or a cage with them unless they have uh, a good skill. amount of skill and talent. <laughs> They're fi they train with them yeah, for a that, reason. That's, it. That, that's a world-class gym. Those guys are serious. Giovanni Bam Bam. Not that I don't think Bam Bam's serious. He's got real recognized real. Oh. Perez got some good footwork. Look at those heavy he's, shots. He's got some good hands. He's got to get out of there because those are some big heavy shots coming. Oh, whoa. He's got to worry about emptying the tank. Otherwise, good feet, good hands. Get out of there. Get out of there. He says, bring it. The fists start to fly. And it is on the back pedal, Saran. Bam Bam in the black, getting stalked by Perez in the green. As a boxer, I mean, just if you envisioned a, a legit boxer, Canelo Alvarez, that footwork kind of matches up. Beautiful job by Bam Bam to get out of the way of that big, huge, heavy leg kick coming from Perez. He needs to get out of there, though. Circle off the fence, up against the howla is not where you want to be when a big, huge guy like this is coming after you, especially as a heavyweight. Oof, good hand. We were told he's yeah, very agile. Yeah, because these punches are slow, but they're hard. Yeah. And that's a big hand. Bam Bam's got to find a way to get inside on this guy. He's got to be able to do some Mike Tyson or even Daniel Cormier type of uh, athleticism to get inside on the chin of uh, Perez. 265 pounds, 6 foot 5 inches tall. And obviously well-trained as a boxer. He's like, it may look soft, but it's hard. <laughs> He literally was like, bring it on. Oh, oh. That's oh. the best punch yet. Straight that left. Straight jab. Popped his head back like a Pez dispenser, and he is all over him. And now Saran's getting even smaller, uh, oh, going those back are heavy into shots. a hole. Saran, five and three. He's got a good record, but he is running into just the freak of nature here. Big, tall, with skills. And Perez is just unloading the chamber when he ever, when he gets the opportunity, and it's going to be a fast night if he continues to do that. Big overhead right. Best that Saran has been able to do thus far. He was supposed to make Saran make his debut in Monterey against Mike Villarreal, who fought Goliath. Perez, he moves uh, very well. You know, he's, uh, he's a big guy, but he's pretty oh, athletic. Big knee. This is a hard target. Doesn't have to move his head because it's a long reach to get there. Saran continues to backpedal. Prez just gives no respect to Saran. He's walking right through all, all of his punches. Now looking for that first underhook. Oh, yeah, and... Um, Rights and lefts. Saran only can go to the body. I was going to say about uh, Bam Bam Saran, he had a full ride scholarship to Iowa University, but he got into trouble and, and went straight to jail right out of high school. Um, he's kind of got that oh, uh, oh. gangster type mentality. I love how he blocked both of those knees, though, and he's still in it. I like still Campbell hurt. said, real recognizes real. He's recognizing him, but it's going to take a lot more than that to put this guy away because yeah. he's got that street thug mentality, and he's not going to give up until he gets virtually killed in there, but of course the ref would never let And Campbell, we, 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 we exulting uh, Perez, but we got to see that power punch. The guy that size, you got to make one that means it. Yeah, well, I would, JP is right. Uh, you know, I'm seeing the same thing. It's uh, Saran's got to do something. He's surviving, but that that's not how you win. Nope, he's got he's to gotta get inside on this guy, but Perez is just so tall. And uh, stalking him. That knee got through. Oh. Left hand, right. Good chin on Saran. but Beautiful chin on Saran, and I think that comes from his boxing uh, career. Nice jab. That left jab hand. snuck in there. That was a great punch by Saran. Big left hook. 
met with a straight oh. two and another straight two, and Bam Bam says, what's up? Yeah, well, he gave him a target. That's what you got. Nice, and I love his head movement. You know, he is getting hit with some shots, but he's doing a really good job of bobbing and weaving. Ooh, uppercut, left uppercut. Saran looking to get on the inside railing here right if up he can. Body. Kick of the lead leg. Ooh. Perez from Northern California. Saran oh, he's just showing south. off now. Nice. Great. I love when heavyweights go to round two. <laughs> you know, some we don't hear too often. Get to the heavyweights to round two. Who knows what could happen? Uh, but bought some time there and looked a little more comfortable by the end of round one. Here we go, round two. Perez upright, looks okay. Again, Saran looking to get inside. Jab, jab, jab. Saran's doing a good job of always having his head offline. You know, he's never a stationary target with his head. He's got great head movement. And, uh, you know, as far as damage goes, he's barely got a scratch on him, whereas Perez got that lip that is all bloody. Actually, uh, drew blood. Oh, big knee, big, big knee. Knees. Big left, right. That's hook. good. Me. Perez, all of those connecting. Right to the, the body. knees Ooh. are working. Flying knee. Oh. oh, but then Saran bounces back. Saran with his own shots. And this is where he's going to find his success. you got to get inside on a big guy like this. Put easily into that one underhook. You didn't, did, you, did you mention the, the Tybo connection to Saran yet? Oh, yeah, no, Ty Bo. Uh, Saran got his start in martial arts from Ty Bo, Billy Blanks. Billy Blanks makes the show. Billy Isn't Blanks that true of Dana White as well? Well, <laughs> I don't know. Sounds like it could be. I All remember right, my mama the in the early 90s doing that Ty Bo. I remember that. Looking to his corner for advice, Saran trying to get his guard back. He needs an underhook. You know, we're on the ground. Saran did have a, a wrestling scholarship to study oh my in gosh. Iowa. Iowa very well regarded. You know, I wouldn't over. want this guy sitting on my chest. Uh -oh. It's over. No, that's a lot of weight. It's got to be over. Jesus, he's huge in a good way. Like, this guy's using his size correctly. A whole lot of humanity down there. And there is blood around the right eye of Perez. So Saran did find a, a way in. Nicely done. Trying to get back to his feet, but Perez says, sit down. This is where he could do a lot of damage. That's a lot of weight. Right in front of our Spanish broadcast team. Blood coming from the ear of Perez, and I don't know if it's his blood or if it's uh, Bam Bam's that's blood. A, that's Perez right over that right eye. Hanging on. Saran's not going down without a fight, and he's doing a good job. He's been able to draw blood from Perez multiple times. I like that. Looking for the heavyweights here at Combate Americas, and who can deliver the goods here? And Perez is such a big force to be reckoned with. You don't want a guy like that on top of you, raining down punches. And elbows. The guard of Bam Bam is wide open. If uh, Perez wanted to pass his guard, he easily could and get right back into that mount where he had uh, a good advantage. And Saran may be hoping to take this as far as he can, as, uh, assuming as many would that a man this size would eventually get tired, although so far he's looking yeah, pretty well yet. maintained. Not yet. Nicely done inside control. What's great about uh, Prez is that he didn't need to pass his guard to, to get the advantage. He could bust him up from guard, and now yeah, he the worked guard his wasn't way to effective his, in no. any way. It wasn't helping him. It wasn't in the threat at all, and worked into mount, and now he has back mount, taking the back, Perez. Nice wrist control on the left side, looking to sneak in his own rear naked choke. Trying to soften him up so he can get his chin up higher. Boom. All right, now in the back, doesn't nowhere near getting a choke. There he gives it a shot. Saran needs to break that Nowhere figure four it. triangle, either that or just spin out as fast as he can like an alligator to reverse his position. The alligator reverse spin. There it is. See what I'm talking? There it is. That's exactly right. what I and He's got a minute to work here. Nostradamus over here. <laughs> <laughs> you got a new nickname. <laughs> Drop Venezuela <laughs> Vixen. Juliana Nostradamus. Yes. Bam Bam. Settle your position, Bam Bam. SoCal getting on top of NorCal here. Settle your position, Bam Bam. Get that hook in, Bam Bam. Oh, 
Crowd going crazy. They love this. Real recognizes real. Get that hook in. Yes, taking the back. Bam, bam. Reversing his position. Yeah. Gets on top. Going for a north south choke, looks like. All right. Ooh. How about that? Dropping that shoulder. And he's got it locked Ooh. in. Ooh. Nowhere to go for Perez. Tap oh, out. my God. Yes. He tapped him out. <laughs> Yeah, real recognizes real. I'm so happy. Oh, we I think we're all rooting oh, for it. The oh, gosh, my gosh. Gosh. The North and South. Uh, oh my real gosh. Real recognizes real. Oh wow. What a, wow. Yeah. yeah. Oh look at Alberto all loves heart. this too. All heart. Yeah, that's oh. great. I'm so happy for him. Oh, I'm so happy for him. Here we go. Rear naked choke. Attempt from Perez. You called it, Benya. Yeah, he's going to alligator roll right to the top, reverse his position. One, two, three, reverse. Got on top. And I love this. He didn't get too excited. He settles in in that north south choke. I believe he's going to clasp his hands here. The north south choke. Have, have we seen one of those in combate before? I, I have don't, not. I, I don't remember one. But I love that. That is beautiful. Oh, Perez has got to be hugely disappointed as he had everything going on this fight. Saran bought his time. Yes. And from the jaws uh, of defeat, awesome. yes. Afro. We, but I do want to see Perez come back and fight Goliath. We got to bring Goliath up or take Perez down there, let them beat the shit out of each other. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Look at him with the little uh, uh, bam, beanie bam. baby. This is great. That's the stuff. quote That's of the night. Let's go to Lupe Contreras. 35 seconds of the second episode, ladies and gentlemen, the official time. Four minutes, 35 seconds of round number two. El vencedor por su misión, your winner by way of submission. Give it up for Giovanni! Bam Bam Saran!